How-to videos are very common. If you are ever in need of knowing an answer to some kind of question, probably there's a video right there online. But you know and I know that there are some videos that we just need to stay away from because of the look, maybe the feel. Here's what you need to do to create a good how-to video. Step one, narrow down your topic to a simple concept. Think of you as the viewer looking for an answer. Most people do not want to watch a 20 minute video on how to ski when all they need to know is how to do a ski jump. People want what they want now. Step two, create a list of steps that gives instructions on how to attain the end product. Do not go off on tangents. Step three, write a narration to your video. Use your steps as the basis for your narration, but use a personable and conversational language. Step four, transfer your narrative script to the audio column in a video script. This will allow you to break down your script by shots and give you an idea of shots you will need to support your video. You'll need to decide when you will want to be seen on camera as the host doing a stand-up or when you will just want to hear your voice doing a voiceover while showing other video. Step 5. Using a camera and a microphone, record yourself narrating your video. This will later be used for voiceovers for your video or a host stand-up that shows you on location showing you how to do something. Step 6. Record your B-roll, or in other words, your video, that will cover parts of your voice. It's best if you shoot in sequences. Show continuous action when you are talking about one particular thing. In other words, start with a long shot to give your audience an idea of the location, but then use close-ups to show detail. Step 7. Capture and upload all of your video into a new project folder on your computer workstation. Remember to have an organized approach when managing your video files. Step 8. Build a new editing project and import all your media that you will need. Step 9. Begin editing by first laying down your voiceovers and stand-ups. This will be known as our A-roll. A-roll is everything that sets your time length in your video. Step 10. Create and insert graphics that label and number your steps. Next, add your cover shots otherwise known as B-roll, to align with the voiceovers. If you say, use a 9 16 wrench, then you must show a 9 16 wrench. Finesse your video. Add a soundtrack to match the mood. Create and insert an opening title that expresses the theme. Create credits that give recognition to people who worked or performed in your video. Last step. When you are done editing, you'll need to export your video as a whole. Decide if you will use this on the web or if it will be distributed on media such as a DVD. Export the video using the proper settings. So there you have it, a solid how-to video on how to make a how-to video. Good luck and hopefully you can try this all on your own.